Welcome back to the basket, man. I know it's been a minute since we posted a video. We wanted to do a little in-store tour. We've posted a lot of videos and it's all been basketball mainly. We haven't really got to show you guys the store and like really appreciate it. So this is what that video is gonna be pretty much. We just got a little shipment in, um, lots of shoes. This is about half of them. But yeah, man, welcome back to the basket. That's the way he live. I'm catching on, turn my Mac in on, bring a German home to the creek. Google where he live. I don't know where right, it's How we look, good. A whole little drip check action. All right, let's get it. You ready? Boom, we'll start up top. Stranger's cap, got it from Focus Group. They gifted it to me, love. Uh, Stussy, wash gray tee, little hit on the back. This is not my sister's shirt. Stussy or Stussy? I'm pretty sure it's Stussy, isn't Stussy. it? Stussy. It is Stussy? Stussy, Stussy. Uh, it's Stussy. It, it is? It's Stussy. Yeah, because I always said Stussy. Same. And everyone's <laughs> like, it's Stussy. Stussy. I'd right. always get clowned on. Mm. And then boom, Nike Tech. Some easy. Off-white blazers on the feet. I wear these literally every day. They just don't get dirty. I lost the zip tie though. So boom, story time, right? I'm about to wear them out. And I was like, do I wear the zip tie? Do I not? Wore it out. I'm walking. I feel somebody step on the zip tie, take a step, look down, it's gone. And so I'm like, that's part of the whole ensemble. Like, if I try to resell these, what am I gonna do, you know? Uh, but yeah, off wheezies on the feet, my drip. Key, drip check. Coming in, starting off with the Herschel Beanie again. Then we got the Jordan little jersey tee, I don't even know. Got the Wilson runner track tennis pants. And then we rock in the Shadow 2.0 Jordan 1s today. I always will have a Jordan 1 on my feet. Add on with a little bling, got a little bracelet, some rings. Ooh, most definitely. Keep it black, match the weather outside, a little gray. Starting the year off right, let's go. <laughs> Question is, whose drip is better, me or Key? So, um, who you got? I want you because you're rocking the Stussy. Let's go! Fire! Thank you. <laughs> Appreciate you. That's one zero. One, one oh. One, one oh. oh. I gotta get you. Let's go! Two, two and oh. Thank you, man. All right. <laughs> yeah, pair of Lawson Founds. Size 10 and a half. Mark has been all over the place on these. 10 and a half. I would want to be at like 360. Yeah, got you for sure. What was like your bottom dollar for? Yeah. 390? Nah, yeah, for sure. No worries, bro. Appreciate you bringing them in, though. All right, well, that was, that was literally, we, at 2 o'clock every day, no matter if it's slow, busy, 2 o'clock, always hits. Hi! Hi! How's it going? I'm just not cold. Hello! Hello! You guys remember oh, hey. Monica? Yeah, I bet. Hey. Why didn't three last night. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna just say we went on a journey and we had a great time. Life is beautiful, life is great. Everybody smile, move, say hi to your neighbors, check on your people, and love, always. Am I right? Always, always. Yes. always. Love, peace. <laughs> love, peace, and chicken grease. <laughs> Follow me, guys. First off, this is the sneaker wall. The way we have the sneaker wall set up is from bottom to top, as far as sizing goes. It's all by the player stickers. So you got like LeBron six, uh, Mellow 7, Kobe 8. That could be a D-Way 9 or that could be a Jordan USA 9. We have them all in size order. So that whole row is that size and the half sizes. So half sizes are just mixed into that row pretty much. We tried to go left to right with the shoes. We just couldn't fit as many out. So we had to go from bottom to top. But so it'll be 8, 8 and a half, 9, 9 and a half, 10, 10 and a half, and so on. The very top is 14 and up. So we got our uh, little Bugs Bunny up there holding down the fort. Just letting everybody know that their shoes are fire. Give me a show me the most slept on shoe on this wall. Most slept on shoe. That's a great question. Honestly? No, 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 no. This is the most slept on shoe. I don't care what nobody says. Taxi Jordan 1. Quality is there, absolutely amazing. And I thought by Christmas these were gonna go up, but they just didn't. They're sitting around like two. Um, but what it was, the lost and found came out. 
The anticipation behind this shoe was so crazy that this got slept on. But if you guys remember the bread toe that came out 2017, it was doing what this did. It was hitting for like 250, 275. Now it's a six, seven, eight hundred dollar shoe. And so it's same quality, damn near. Color is amazing. It's not too bright of a yellow. It's kind of like a nice like yellow orangish. So it's not too bright and like it's it's wearable, but just price isn't there. So um, and then right above you here, we got Michael Jordan. He's our security. He just looks over the shop and whoever <laughs> whoever tries to run out with stuff, he just drops down and traps them. So this is our infamous Barbie wall. In 1998, they did a collab with the NBA and that's it. They didn't do them ever again. So we tried to clear the internet of them. Every time we see one, we buy it. We're trying to get every single one possible. The, what was it? Dallas Mavericks. What other one key was hard to find? Miami Heat. Miami Heat and Dallas Mavericks, two very hard to find ones. Um, but yeah. Oh, we got one. Miami. Yee. Oh, Black Miami Heat. Okay, got you, got you. Never mind. What else? Sonics cap, absolute fire. Brand new with tags, crispy. This is actually hard. I might need this. I don't know. Hat wall looking a little light. Like I said, Christmas. Clean this out. Um, let's see, what else we got? Starting lineup wall. We try to get as many of these as possible. It used to be bigger. Had to consolidate just because we have more stuff now. It's just a mess over here. Look at this. Beautiful case, just a mess. We realize we post a lot of videos and we haven't really highlighted like anything in the store. Obviously we're a basketball store, so we post a lot of basketball stuff. But as far as the store goes, just want to show you a little bit of uh, heat. So boom, Travis Scott one came out. When did this come out? December 15th. December 15th. Or like 14th in Singapore. Right. Oh, for real? Yeah. Well, people just got their pairs. So uh, we got a couple pairs in. Got one right here. I personally think this is the best Travis Scott that's ever come out. I second that. I don't yeah. even like the hype shit, and I'm, I would drop money on that shit. Yeah, yeah. This goes with the fit right there. You know what I'm right saying? Now, it's just like this goes with everything. And I would say the brown lows are my, like, 1B, but I think this is number one for me. Out of highs, lows, all that, this is the one for sure. So we got a 12 and a half, and then we got an 11 and a half. And the packaging on this is absolutely ridiculous. Like they really killed it. So first off the box or the box cover, it's like little Jordan, Air Jordan Wings logo, Cactus Jack, Nike Air all over, just super clean. And then everything is murdered out. The whole box is just, everything is black. And boom, comes with the bandana. The dope thing about the bandana is that it has like the Jordan logo, Cactus Jack, just well executed. And boom, another one. This is the 11 and a half. Then we got the 12 here. Oh, hands crazy. So boom, this is honestly a beautiful shoe. So they did like the new buck right here. Quality is amazing. And they did like the rougher suede on the back. And if you can kind of tell on the 11 and a half compared to the 12 and a half, it's like slightly different. This is a little bit more rough. This is a little bit more fine, but I mean, Nike's consistency throughout pairs is not consistent. So you'll see that with a bunch of different shoes, but they did the wax laces quality. I think this shoe will just last really well over time compared to like, let's say frags, right? It's a white shoe and it's like, there's a lot of white on it. So you could see the wear as you wear them. Not that it looks bad, but I feel like the more you wear this shoe, it'll have so much life going down the road. So, so it comes with two sets of laces, the other laces all red to match the Cactus Jack hit here. And then you got the zebra laces. I feel like these are gonna hit. I feel like these are gonna be super dope. I'm curious to see what people do with these. Number one, Travis, in my opinion, can't go wrong with all black. And then the white stitching makes the shoe pop. So yeah. These are crazy. Gotta keep them clean, man. Keep your shoes clean. Wear your shoes, but keep them clean, you know? How do you keep your shoes clean? <laughs> uh, you walk like this. That's how you keep your shoes clean. <laughs> Burp easy. Say it was good. He's like, ran out of gas. Ran out of gas. <laughs> you ran out of gas? <laughs> this boy, how you go to the employee store to spend money and then run out of gas? You got a car full of stuff with no gas. So you dead. just got it. All right, I'm gonna see you soon. Or I mean, I, <laughs> maybe, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> All right.
I gotta wash my hands because I got a shit ton of gasoline on it. <laughs> you, just, you ran out of gas. Oh, that's right, you were on FaceTime. Yeah. You spilled the gas? Yeah, all over my hands. Jesus. Don't shake me up yet. Bert Bennett, man. <laughs> so we did a skit about pandas. So kids come in and call any dunk a panda. So what was the situation where that kid came in? Sure, kid. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it wasn't a kid. It wasn't a kid. It was a person. Um, this person came back from England. I remember. Slow morning. They come in, asking for a panda. Get them plugged up with the panda. Of course, the black and white one. And then once the transaction was over, that person was like, "You got any other pandas?" And I'm like, "What? What? I just sold you one. You want another one?" I'm like, "I don't have any more in that size." And then that person went to the wall and put like, "What about this? You got a blue one, a green one right there." And I'm like. All right, like, I, okay, cool. You can run with it. Yeah, you can name yeah. it, and you can't hate them because look at Nike. They changed the name of their shoe three different times, from the yellow toe to the taxi mm -hmm. to that. They the reimagined, the reimagined, lost and found. Mm -hmm. They dropped a Jordan one high, low, different colorway. Called them both the beach cars. Yeah, right, right, right. You can't hate, so. Yeah, so it, 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 yeah, you can't really hate like on the people who don't know the names. It was just a funny skit that we thought of like off the top of our head. So. Um, you'll see it, so we'll, we'll put it right here. Go to our TikTok, you'll see. Can I help you find anything, bro? Yeah, man, actually, I'm looking for some pandas. Yeah, we got some right here, bro. These are cool, man, but I need the blue pandas. Blue pandas? Yeah, blue pandas. Pandas. Blue. No, red pandas. Of course, I want the blue pandas. You mean these? Yes, thank you, man. Blue pandas. Let's do it. All right, your ball. Ready? Right, check up. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, so close. Oh, we made it. Hey, count it, I guess. All right. I right, gotta play defense. Oh. 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 Ah. <laughs> Goal tending. Okay, 2 1. Game point. Ready? You ain't doing it again. <laughs> oh my! God. Bro, I just lost. Alright, my man. Free keychain. Come on down. Alright, any of these keychains right here. You pick any one you want. Can't believe I just lost. The red one? Oh. Yes, sir. What's your name, bro? Mikey. Mikey? Nice to meet you. I'm Jalen. Nice to meet you. Yes, sir. I'm a retired athlete. Alright? <laughs> You're going to the NBA. I know it. I can see it. See it in your eyes. Oh, you do? Oh, you follow us on TikTok? Out. Yes, sir. You yeah. saw the blue panda? Yeah, yeah, I was in the live. Nice to meet you, man. I'm Jalen. Yes, sir. I'm Keyshawn. Right. Nice, nice to meet you, man. Yeah, for sure, bro. Yeah. Yeah. If I score this, everybody subscribe. Okay. Let's go. You heard Mikey. Yes, yeah. sir. Subscribe. Everybody go subscribe. Shout, Shout out, out to, back to the basket. basket. Yes, sir. Fire, man. Everybody go subscribe ASAP. Just so dope, man. Like, that's literally why we do this. You know what I'm saying? Reason why. Yeah. Like how we were saying, like, there's so many sneaker stores open nowadays. It's all the same stuff. Supreme, Off-White, and it's very, like, transactional, it feels like. It's like, oh, this is a hype sneaker. Come buy it from us. Bro, we just want to come with a warmth and, like, just come appreciate the stuff that we have, you know? Like, we don't even care if you buy anything for real. Obviously, we want to sell stuff, but, like, that. Kicking it with little kids. They love basketball. The, their dad was looking around at stuff, and, like, you know, we're, we're trying to bridge that gap between the young and the old. Like, the kids, they come in. They love the shoes. They play basketball. And then the parents, they look around and just, like, it brings them back to their childhood, back when they had their kids. They get to show they have that time going back in history with their kids and show them what they grew up with and pass it on and we just get to be there in the and everything circle. there's like a talking point like you know on this side it's more so like the older memorabilia they'll um they'll tell their kids like oh this is what i had when i was little when i was your age and then <laughs> the kids are usually like yeah yeah yeah, cool yeah. whatever <laughs> all they want to see is the sneakers but it's like some kids they love the the Oh, a little young bull that ha just knows the history of basketball, like everything. Oh, yeah. Like we have some kids come in like eight, nine, ten years old that just know the history. And it's like, that's why we're here. Like we, we love basketball and like we're, we're trying to bring people together through basketball. Hey, all right, man. 
beautiful day today. Um, way more busy than I thought it was gonna be. Real. Yeah, man, we got packed out. Packed ASAP. out. Um, but yeah, showed you a little bit of the store. Um, some buyouts, uh, some purchases. What else did we do in this video? Our message, what we like to do for the community. Yep. We cover yep. a little bit of everything. Yeah, yeah. Like we just wanted to show you um, a little bit of in-store stuff just because we haven't got a chance to do that with summer and hoops in the park and all that stuff. We showed you a lot of basketball, but we wanted to show you the store. So we're going to be doing a lot more in-store stuff now that the weather is not that great. Not that great. Um, freezing, actually. Free. I hate it. <laughs> I'm always cold 24-7. So that ice storm killing me yeah but um anyways man yeah we appreciate you guys so much videos are gonna start coming a lot more often we don't want to keep you guys waiting so we appreciate you guys support if you haven't already like comment subscribe we want to get as many videos out as possible and we can only do that if you guys subscribe so and let us know what you want so we'll be up to it yes sir 100 yes, man sir. peace peace